Welcome my friends, so glad you could join me. My name is Wonka and today we're gonna be playing Car Mechanic Simulator 2018. If you guys are still enjoying, if you wanna see more, do me a favor, tickle that like button, leave me a comment down below. As always, if you're new here or you haven't already, be sure to punch your golden ticket by hitting that subscribe button. While you're down there, be sure to leave your suggestion for customization and paint for the vehicle we do today. You can leave your car requests, license plate ideas, all that good stuff in the comments section below. And without further ado, let's just hop right in. I hope you guys enjoy, and I think you will. Now, our first order of business is our beautiful Plymouth. Speaking of which, there have been numerous hop fixes. I took a little bit of time off from Car Mechanic Simulator just to avoid any, any more bugs to annoy me. And everything should be fixed now. Everything should be a lot better. And I mean, look, I'm not trying to hate, you know, I'm not, I, I'm not working behind the scenes. I don't know exactly what happened, but you know, at a certain point you give so many chances and at some point you just got to take a stand and uh, hope to God that the gaming industry goes a little bit towards where it used to be rather than where it's going. You know, I want to try these Plymouths out, but I'm just a little worried. And because I, you know, I'm, I'm noticing that the consumer is getting a lot smarter. And um, I just hope that we get some better practice in in many aspects, you know, many aspects of of how games are these days in the industry. And by the way, one bug seems like a stretch. But enough about that. That's neither here nor there. I appreciate all the work that you guys do over there, Red Dot. I'm just not gonna kiss any ass for some free codes like a lot of others tend to do. And I'm, I'm gonna tell it how it is and uh, put some pressure on the industry. As, uh, even if it's just a little bit, just a little, just a little pinky's worth of pressure, you know? But I'm, 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 a, I'm gonna put all my pinky power into it. So thank you for the suggestion. We kept it Denmark plates, but we changed it too fast for you. If you didn't know, it was originally found in Denmark according to the plates that came on it. We went with the red, some nice big meaties in the back. You get the idea, looks beautiful. The most important part of the day is sending your car to collect dust. Now I was thinking about doing this one. This is a Roadrunner, the other Plymouth. Um, and this one has the big old 426 V8 for all you engine buffs out there. And uh, we're gonna do it, but maybe not today, we'll just We'll just save that for a rainy day. So I was at the auction, and a little V8 rolled up, and it happened to be sitting inside of a pacer. That's right, everybody. We're doing a pacer. But a little bit later on in the auction, I noticed if I waited, I could get the one with the blown V8. That's right. We got a supercharged V8 engine in a damn pacer. How could I not, how could I not do this? I would be silly not to. Absolutely insane. You should call for help if I ever skip over a pacer with a blown V8. I think it's gonna be fun. I know a lot of people think these cars are ugly. I think they got their own little charm. I like them. Don't be so mean to them. I feel mean. Funny story, um, before we get into it here, as we, we'll, we'll take apart the uh, things we gotta take apart to get that engine out of there. But I took my car into the shop because it has some problems that have to be taken care of before it gets painted. For those of you that have been here, since I said I was gonna paint my car, it's coming. It's coming, but there was some other problems that have kind of interfered, let's just say. But it is now in the shop, not getting painted, but getting repairs done to it that it needs. And um, they, they called me and let me know that the labor is gonna be a little bit a little bit on the higher side because I got some seized bolts, apparently one broke on them. I feel bad because I know how annoying it is to work on a car that has some some older parts and is a little bit seized. Because of that, I, I feel, I'm feeling the guilt. I'm feeling the, I'm feeling the shared mechanic guilt. Not that I'm a mechanic, not that playing this game makes me a mechanic. I just have worked on a car before and I know how much they're probably cursing me, probably cursing my car. I, f I feel really bad, but someone's got to do it and, it, and they have more tools than me. Look, if they want to give me their tools, I will gladly go in and, and do some 
some crappy stuff. All right, but you're gonna have to take a little bit off the price because they're asking for a fair chunk of change. There we go. We got a relatively tiny V8, <laughs> if you ask me, but with a big old supercharger, so it makes up for everything. So that's my story of the day. Um, wish, wish my car luck. Wish those mechanics luck in the comments because they, they're gonna need it, and um, I really do hope that my car cooperates for them. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> But I mean, it's their job, and I'm paying for it, so I still feel bad, though, because <laughs> they're gonna hate me. They're gonna hate me. I'm scared to show my face. I mean, they're nice guys. They generally liked me before this, so <laughs> we'll see. All right, let's take all these pieces off, because I believe that they all can be fixed, except for, like, the windows, stuff like that. Um, but other than that, it should all be fixable. I don't know why, but my scroll doesn't work anymore, and I really like the scroll. Realize I might as well show you guys on the old shop car over here. We got some... nope, that's not what I wanted. We got some new animations, apparently, for some of these things. Obviously, we can't do that one. I just clicked on the first one I saw. Ooh, ah. Looks the same for that. Let's uh, let's see <laughs> see if any of these actually seem different. Oh, there's some numbers on it now. I don't know if there was always numbers on it. That could be new. What's a good number? <laughs> was there numbers on this thing? I don't even know. Let's just get out of here. What a waste of time. Get it? Let's just get out of here. Cause we got a car to build. Everything should be bought. Everything should be ready to go. Let's put her up in the air like we just don't care. Now the question is, will it spin out or put up a good time? We'll find out. I'm, I'm thinking it might spin out though. Sometimes you just think you remembered everything, and then you realize you remembered nothing. Now I literally remembered the suspension this time, the rim, the tire, but of course, 
Forgot to balance it. All right, let's hope everything goes a little smoother on the engine. That moment when you realize that I'm pretty sure there's aftermarket hits. Oh, I'm so good at life. All right, where were we? Something's missing. I can't quite put my finger on it. Oh, that's the wrong one. Uh, I wish I wish performance parts would just come first. Just somehow override these other ones, even if they're fixed. Just because it makes for a little bit more of a smooth ride, you know? And that's what we all about here is the smooth ride. Not a free ride. A smooth ride. And just like magic, it's back in. Whoa. All right, we need to get some new glass and then new paint because I, I can't, I can't live with the Barney on it. I just, it's not good. So uh, turns out I went to the store to buy um, one thing and um, there was just other goodies that caught my eye. Isn't that always the case? Now I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep the chrome mirrors, but if you guys want the painted mirrors, feel free to uh, let me know, along with any of your other customization options that you want to see. While you're down there, be sure to leave your suggestion for customization and paint for the vehicle we do today. You can leave your car requests, license plate ideas, all that good stuff in the comment section below. We've got a couple of hoods. I don't know if they're gonna work with the with the blower. <laughs> the exhibit A. I don't know what hood that was. I think that was hood B. Oh, that works. It kind of covers, you know, it's, it's kind of where the blower should be, you know, a little bit. A little bit, a little bit. All right, that one works out pretty nice. I like it. I don't know how well other ones are going to work. Let's try this one. Ooh, carbon fiber. Oh, there's actually a, a, a slit cut for the supercharger on that one. That's convenient. The carbon's nice. I kind of like the one where it's like cut out, so it's not just clipping through. and actually has like a proper supercharger, supercharger cut out. Or the blower one, but that one just obstructs your view. I'm gonna go with this one. If you guys want a different one, you know, you know what to do. Called Ghostbusters. So B just kind of gets rid of the uh, the little notches that it has in it, or whatever those things are. The little bumper bars. <laughs> I don't know what they are. 
Um, let's see what D is. Oh, a nice little splitter. No bumper. I kind of like that. We might go with that one. But I think the last one... Oh, now it's all the way down there. That's, that's interesting how that works out. But I'm glad it does work out. It's just a painted bumper, obviously. Plain Jane, not my style. We're going with the little splitter. No bumper. I like it. And the chrome one without the little bumper bars. I think we gotta go painted because this thing's just like a drag machine. The chrome bumper is just not good. But I like the chrome mirrors. If you guys want me to change those, we can. There are a painted variation on the mirrors. But I kind of like it. I kind of like it how it is. So let's... I also did the rims, but you can choose whatever rims you want. I kind of want to see what it looks like on the ground. So let's move it into paint. Because the, the purple just is not cutting it. I mean, it looks a little better now. But it's just not cutting it for me. We need... We need something else. Alright, there she is. <laughs> Look at that aggressive forward lean. I think if we go with new tires we should and rims we should go one size up maybe get rid of that wheel arch and it'll just look like it was cut to fit and it'll look good i like it i kept the uh the hood black and the rear bumper black made it this goofy green chameleon whatever put some engine in the engine in the oil you know that's that's what you got to do you put the engine in the oil everybody thinks you put the oil in the engine and that's where they go wrong in racing. That's why they're not as fast as me. In the dino. Cannot start engine. Oh, I forgot to button up the last few things. Damn it. I, do, I don't know why. I don't know what. Don't know what's wrong with me. Don't know what's wrong. I just gotta do the transmission and stuff. Nothing that fascinating. I'll see you in the dyno once it's ready. Alright, we were already pushing a whopping 445 horsepower out of this little pacer. Let's see what we can do now. I'm expecting big things. Show me the money. Oh my goodness. 843 horsepower. Yikes. I, I hope this thing impresses. I'm ready for it to impress. I don't know about y'all. About y'all. With my southern drow. I'm, I'm expecting big things. Why are we... Why are we sitting like that? Alright, seems to be sitting okay out here. But in here, not so much. Alright, well, let's see what she can do. Come on, baby, don't spin out for me, please. Go straight. Nice and straight. Nice and straight. A little... A little less straight. There you go. Nice and straight. It's a thing of beauty. Top speed, 310. Oh, a little more? No, that's it. That's all she's got. 310, 0 to 102.4 seconds. That's amazing in a pacer. 0 to 205 seconds. 5. 200 kilometers per hour. 120 miles in 5 damn seconds. Wow. 10.9 to 300. This thing's insane. Well, that's it, folks. If you guys want to see more, do me a favor, tickle that like button, leave me a comment down below. As always, if you're new here or you haven't already, be sure to punch your golden ticket by hitting that subscribe button and keep your dirty dick beaters off my tools. Take her easy. <laughs>